You may think you're finished with the product, but you are not. You're not even, you may be close, but you're missing one key detail, and that involves the drone, boys. just me. Maybe when I re-edit this footage or edit this footage, I'm gonna be like the fuck was up with my hair? But when I did it today, I was like what is it? I might just go back to the hat, dude. Where'd that person go? They were staring at me, you know talking to my camera, like legit just staring at me going how they disappeared. They think I'm crazy. At least I don't disappear on people. Back here. Backyard. Got a little chill sesh over here, you know. Crack open. Oh, already someone's already someone's already cracking open a cold one. It's finished. Uh, you want one of these? It's a bottle opener. <laughs> I got it. <laughs> right. I gotta like it. This is the legend that is Etienne's dad. What a badass! Is he really doing that? What a badass, dude. Well, I think we're out. You going down? Yeah, we're gonna go to Tillamook. Know. Tillamook. I'm gonna get some, is it jerky? Oh, Do yeah, they sell jerky or cheese? Long jerky sticks and they sell cheese. Yeah, they have cheese. I'm gonna get both. Milk. A lot of cows. You smell it. <laughs> Stopped over at this like in this beautiful forest, Tillamook Forest, right? That's something like that. Something like that. Um, we uh, we're gonna fly the drone, um, get some shots of it. We're traveling to Tillamook right now. Um, we're gonna hit the cheese factory. Uh, like a gas station with two long jerky sticks. A gas station with foot long jerky stick. Um, and then we might go up to Astoria, sea Seaside, and all that. Um, I don't know how far it is. Depending on how much time of the day. We're on the cut. We're on the road to Tillamook right now. Anything you'd like to say? Add to the vlog. It's gonna be, it's gonna be dope. Alright, we may have just stumbled across a huge problem. The drone battery will not charge on this thing I bought for my car. You're gonna have to hit up a Starbucks, man. I might have to sit in a Starbucks with a fucking battery that looks like a fucking bomb. <laughs> For a solid, it takes like a solid 45 minutes. We call the bomb squad. <laughs> then I'll be like, dude, it's for a fucking drone, dude. We hiking. We hiking out here, boys. We're going for an adventure. They used here and no I camping. I saw this fucking like steep ass fucking log bridge. Like, yeah. Dude, we had to turn around and come back. You know it. Oh, dude, this was worth it. Dude, I'm so glad we saw this. Oh, I've never seen water this clear. Dude, me neither. Bro, we might have to, might have to man. pull out the short game. What are your thoughts on that? Short game worth it? Let's get it. Let's get it. But when you come across this kind of water, you it's gotta go all out. You can't pass this. You can't pass, that, you can't pass this. Here, what? Yeah. Hold them above your head. My dumbass forgot to. So the thing I'm charging my GoPro on and all, everything. Good luck. Dude, it could be like a, a 10 minutes. It could be an hour. I'm not gonna take a risk on that. And I was gonna run back real quick, but I asked Etienne because he's fat. 
he's faster and smaller than me. And he did it. He was like, ah. Oh well, what a homie. The rocks are super slippery. I'm gonna say peace. We should go right over there. Yeah, I'm gonna say peace. I mean, we could go, we could go over there, but we have to be here, right? We kinda have no choice to go right there. I mean, you always have a choice, bro. <laughs> Shit, dude, it's gonna be scary taking the camera across that. Oh, yeah, I'm sure. <laughs> what are those bugs? Water skippers or whatever. Are they dangerous? Yeah. Surely, but surely we will make it. Yeah. Oh. Oh, it's fucking slippery in these streets. That's what I'm saying, though. Okay, we got this. Do we? Bro, I don't know. I don't think taking the cam is worth it. We got shots. Shots? Yeah. I can take my phone. Alright. Can, can you, like, put it on the footage and all that? Yeah. I can at least catch myself, not drop the camera. No, we got like, oh, well, I filmed it, but we got like a quarter of the way there and decided against it. Let's go back. That's what life's about right here, guys, adventure. See something new or something cool, you gotta stop and check it out. Got it. There's always time in the day. I'm positive. I don't, is where they make the. Yeah, I don't remember this. This is where they get you, dude. No. I wasn't ready. <laughs> the line forms here. Jesus <laughs> Christ. It's Portland. I was like, what? Close to that. Close to that. all you and me. That's one. I keep trying to film everything, but I'm missing some things. Um, this may be a random vlog, and we, we may be like, how did he get to the Cheesecake Factory? Did he just show up? <laughs> did he teleport? Question, answer to that question is, I might have. How did he get to Pizza Hut? That one I drove to. I didn't uh, film anything. Um, honestly, I'm trying to film as much as I can for Tillamook. Just know, if, you, if you're wondering what Tillamook, Oregon is like, there's a giant cheese factory. I almost said cheesecake factory. That is filled with tourists, which made me feel very at home because I'm a tourist. We had to wait in a line for two hours to get some cheese samples. To sample cheese, which was, was two worth fucking it. hours, man. It was worth it. It was good. It was... It like started off bad, well, not bad, but like it wasn't like it was like three year old cheese, and apparently that's super like rare or good. I don't. Know. Anyway, we are headed to Bay City. It is only three miles away from here, so we're teleporting. I'm teleporting. See you there. I get an extra one of these, dude. Yeah, let's Fucking bro. Eleven dollars for all this shit. It's fucking wild, dude. 11. That's this dude. This is fucking 22 feet of jerky right here. <laughs> 22 feet of meat. Oh, yeah, so that lady uh, liked my style. Um, yeah. She said she really likes long sticks. In bags. In bags. It's really washing those windows. I think it's been getting to his head. Ever since that lady in the gas station said he liked his, she liked his style and his, the way he put big sticks in packages. <laughs> Not a fan. Not a fan? Of whatever this one is. I don't know. But what I do know is it is beautiful. You can't really see it on the camera, but it says, Do not drive up or walk up to view the take photos of the Goonies on a private drive. Police will be calling them to turn around. Just be low key. 
Yeah, it's gotta be that. What I'm concerned with was that there is no way him and I are driving all the way out to Astoria. One is actually a beautiful city, and I'm glad we came here. Yeah, it's beautiful. But we came to get pictures of that house and film that house. I'm gonna name this video the Goonies House. Goonies House. Even though it's for like two seconds of the video. There's no way you can't expect me. You can't blame me for running up there <laughs> and taking a quick little video, a quick little picture. And I'm out of the way. If you're gonna buy that house, be prepared for that. Don't buy a house like that and expect no one to take pictures of it. Or want to take pictures of it. When you Thank you.